everyone uses it. Everyone loves it. And everyone hates it. Text messaging. Have you ever had that feeling of being misunderstood in a text message? Or that you have misunderstood the message? I'm sure everyone has had that experience in one way or another. Hey, can we talk? No, take a second. Maybe close your eyes and feel your body. What does this question trigger in you? Do you feel like this or like that? Or maybe like this or this or something in between? In face-to-face -face conversation, we have additional information like facial expressions, gestures, pitch and body language to communicate our feelings. But we can't do that within text messages. And yeah, we miss a lot of valuable information through that. So we came up with Tanji. Tanji gives you the opportunity to feel the implicit feelings of your conversation partner. Not which ones exactly, but at least whether they are positive or negative. And of course, how intense their expression is. This could strengthen mutual empathy for better communication and more understanding. So it brings forth the non-verbal cues of face-to-face -face communication to your mobile phone. But how did we get here? Of course, we had a lot of questions. We wanted to know which requirements does such an artifact have to fulfill. How can implicit emotions be expressed? How tangible must the feedback be? How can such tangible artifact even look and work like? So we did two workshops. In the first one, we gave them these kits with different scenarios and tasks in it. We wanted to understand if and when certain implicit feelings occur, what triggers bodily reactions and how they could be expressed in material and interaction. With the second workshop, with new participants of course, we aim to get clear design directions or implications to expand on. We split them into two groups, took the results of the first workshop and used them as a base for a 6-3-5 method. The design implications we had after the second workshop were this from the first group and this from the second group. Those are pretty similar. We don't know how, but both groups ended up with a somehow changing phone case. But how can such a tangible artifact be realized? And how do you interact with that? So we started to experiment a lot to build upon the results. We tried this and this and this and finally ended like this. The integration into modern text messaging service is into reactions, since it is a bodily reaction. But how does this look like? You send the message to a friend. When your friend reads the message, you get the emotional reaction. To feel it, you tap on it, you get it. But does it really help to boost empathy? We don't know yet. It is still work in progress.